Well, uh, new this morning, a push to solve the health care worker shortage. Nikkel is here to explain how a leader of a local medical school feels HBCUs can help increase the pipeline of future workers. Hey, good morning once again, Neil. Mary Medical College President and CEO Dr. James Hildreth is taking solutions straight to U.S. Senators. Dr. Hildreth became a familiar face here in the Nashville area earlier in the pandemic, sharing his expertise about the COVID-19 virus. Well, yesterday he testified before the U.S. Senate Committee on Health, Education, Labor and Pensions. The hearing focused on the shortage of health care workers. He says the mission of HBCU medical schools is one he takes personally. I was born in rural Arkansas in the 1950s and watched my father die of cancer because no one would or could care for him. I have been trained at the world's most elite institutions, Harvard, Oxford, Johns Hopkins. Yet I choose to lead Meharry Medical College because Meharry graduates and their counterparts at Howard, Morehouse, and Drew choose to care for people like my father. Poor blacks, poor whites, poor Hispanics, poor Native American people, who deserve to be healthy just like the rest of us. Dr. Hildreth said HBCU medical schools have been underfunded for decades and they're asking for $5 billion over five years to improve their facilities and push more medical workers through the pipeline to fill this great need. It's something he says they're already working on here in Tennessee. We are already partnering with industries to support the education of minority physicians, dentists, nurses, researchers, and public health professionals. We work with neighborhood middle and high school students to introduce them to science and medicine. And at Meharry, we are grateful to Governor Bill Lee and the leadership of the state of Tennessee for supporting a program we have put in place to fast track undergraduate students into medical school who are committed to serving in rural areas in the state of Tennessee. So Dr. Hildreth also says while the funds they're requesting are significant, they're a drop in the bucket compared to other budget items and will pay immediate dividends in uh, quickly expanding the healthcare worker pipeline and closing the health disparity gap. Nikki.